Good morning, everybody. This is NCP. I uh, did a local run last night to Sam's Club, and for the most part, the uh, store is stocked. Um, we've been getting ready for the, you know, maybe possible lockdown here. One thing I noticed was there was a lot of food available, but just one item per uh, shopping cart. So we were both shopping. But, um, everything, <coughs> excuse me, everything that was like pre-made stuff uh, was hard to come by. But individual mats, or I'm sorry, materials, a little bit of a game slip there. Um, individual materials for making food or food components or things to make meals from was pretty much, you know, in stock. I see now I forgot my biscottis. Dang. But if you look around, like, there's flour. We got some flour. Not a lot of bread eaters, but still. Uh, we had limits of, uh, you know, one item there. So I got, you know, I think it was five dozen eggs there or maybe it was 15. I don't remember. It's just a big box there. But, uh, the flour was still there, um, cooking oils and such was still there, so, yeah, I didn't really plan a lot of this video to do commentary, but I went ahead and muted that sound to help preserve, uh, people's privacy, but like I said, a lot of the material was there, like, here we were in the rice aisle, um, the different brands are there, but, um, one thing we were looking for over here was like tuna. We already had some, but we didn't need any. Uh, here was some of the frozen section. I was trying to be discreet while recording this and not, you know, trying to get people's faces. So it's it's a jumbled up little videos. And here I'm walking down the aisles. <clears throat> um, mostly hand sanitizer was not found at the end of this aisle. Uh, antibacterial soaps were not found. Maybe hand washing, I didn't look, but I mean like the liquid soaps, you know, like all the antibacterials. Uh, diapers were well in stock. Um, I didn't check the toilet paper aisle. Sorry, I didn't think about it. Um, I thought it was here, but it's actually on the other side of the store, so. But as you can see, everything is pretty much in stock still. So, you don't really need to panic. Or panic stock up because the trucks are running and uh, there's a lot of stuff to be had, essentials. Um, we weren't limited by going in like at uh, Costco. We were just, just went right in, in and out. One thing um, that was different is we were wearing masks and gloves. And we were the only one. Uh, my wife said she saw someone else wearing it. But it was a little thin paper mask. We were using Molex N100s, and uh, I got some, some, some weird looks, and uh, it seemed to make people kind of want to distance from us, so that was okay. You know, I didn't want to be hanging out anyway, but we had the gloves on, <clears throat> and we had hand sanitizer, and we were sanitizing the gloves over our hands, so anytime we did something, like picked up a box, we would sanitize the gloves. This is just an extra layer of protection. Probably not needed, but who knows. Um, we wear our personal protective equipment all the way home. When I got home, we unloaded everything from the car. And then we uh, sterilized the car. No, first we did the refrigerator. We ran the ozone in the refrigerator for like five minutes. And, um, and just let it set for three hours to uh, disinfect. Now, ozone, like I said, will... Uh, We'll start to degrade stuff. Um, you know, it's a free radical oxygen and it just wants to mess up everything it touches. So there's pros and cons there. But this pandemic won't last long enough, in my opinion, to cause any problems. And then we took and uh, ozone the car. Uh, just put it through the window and left it out there. And ran that for a sterilization cycle of, I think it was 30 minutes on that one. And uh, that took care of the car. I opened up the, the barrier between the back seats and the trunk. And I just let the ozone go everywhere in there uh, to sanitize the car. But that was our quick trip to uh, Sam's Club. I just want to let you know there's really no need at this time to panic or, you know, buy all the stuff. Now, I did buy a lot of eggs. We eat a lot of eggs here. And uh, 
we only bought one one of those big crates of I think it's 15 dozen eggs but like I said we eat a lot of eggs here so that's what's up this is MCP things are good um yeah everything's everything's okay here um neighbors are okay so no problems this time and this today is let's see what is today Wednesday March 25th at 7 30 in the morning and this was yesterday about 3 p.m. at Sam's Club. So, all right, have a good one, everybody. This is NCP. Stay safe and stay vigilant with uh, your hand washing. And if you don't need to be out, stay home. So, have a good one, everybody. NCP out.